I've wanted to learn how to do that since I was a little kid. But my family grew up poor. We didn't have money for karate class or martial arts. I don't friggin' know how to break a board. But I'm giving myself 14 days to figure that shit out or suffer the consequences. Okay, so it's day one and I think the move has to be figure out what it is that we're punching in half with our fists. Because depending on what it is, that's gonna determine how we're training. So I did a little bit of research online, just to see what was out there. Just to see. Can I break the world's hardest board with a one inch punch? I got four boards from easy to impossible. Subscribe for more content. God. So, that's not good for my hand, but at least this one's not gonna snap like a dry twig if it's attacked by a small child. Okay, I've got the board here, and I'm really hoping that I don't break my own fist on this thing. We'll see. <laughs> Holy sh I was not expecting that to work. Okay, I'm not generally a very enthusiastic person, but that was amazing. It's hard to describe exactly what's so satisfying about the process, but just know that it is extremely satisfying. And if you're planning on doing this at home for yourself, make sure that you learn the proper technique. For instance, you only want to be punching with these first two knuckles right here, and not the last two at the end because that's how you break your fist. And if you're a cheapskate like me and you're buying your own wood, make sure that it's not a hardwood like oak because you're gonna have a hard time breaking through that shit. And that's about it. I appreciate you being here and watching all the way to the end. It makes a huge difference to me. Till next time. Subscribe if you want me to make more.